So sorry. Let me see. Her ear canal is so swollen, nothing can fit. I can't get my finger in there. this out, huh? Look over there. So swollen, my thumb can't fit. I just kind of move it, push around that cotton ball. See, there's a little lip in here, right here, right under there. Look. If I don't get that, that stays in there. Let's see, one more in there, in there, that little nook right there. 
under that nook. Oh, look at all that. Ugh. Poor guy. Okay, I'm sorry, Sonny. Let me see. A little bit more here. Okay, let me see. Just right here. Back and forward, back and forward. Around that lip there. Underneath, up and around. Okay, okay. All right, that's good enough. Flush the ear. Here we go. I'm gonna pour it from the top. And we'll repeat. Later today, we'll do it again. Okay, shake. Wanna shake? Come on now. Come on. Almost done.
So after he is, we flushed and he shook and I went to the other ear and came back over here, there's more stuff that popped up right here, right? That he's shaking out. And that's why that maliceic audit is so helpful. You want to flush anything down the ear canal back up to where you see how it came over here now? Yeah, absolutely. It's swollen it's, it, or irritated. No, 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 no. I know. I know. No, 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 no. I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I have to do this. Okay. I'm sorry. We have to clean it. Okay. Okay. Come here. No. That's... No. 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 But he shook his head and then more stuff came like here so you could wipe it out. So you're gonna do this. That's why you come back and do it twice a day or see your veterinarian. But some veterinarians prefer the groomer to handle the ear hair pulling and all that kind of stuff. You don't wanna keep going until this is extremely raw. It is irritated, but you have to start somewhere and get all that stuff out of the way. We already cleaned and flushed. So that's why a twice a day is really effective. Hey you guys. So we did the ear cleaning, ear flushing for Mason's dog, Sonny. And he went home and came back with Malacetic Audic, which I had sold him a while back, which was almost full, and this bottle. He said, these are the two things I've been using. And so the first thing I did was look at the expiration dates. So the Malacetic Audic doesn't expire until 2022, so we're good there to use that. But this sucker, this expires 09, 2016. So one of the first things that you need to do is, and when you're trying to, trying to tell people that you're using something or whatever, you need to make sure your stuff's not expired. So I said, Mason, can I throw that away for you? And he said, yeah, Dee Dee, you can throw it away for me. So he's going to clean and flush daily until it clears up and then extend it longer until it's all gone. He is welcome to see his veterinarian. I am not a veterinarian. I'm a groomer. Groomers clean dogs ears. That's what we're here to do. Ears, toenails, anal glands ear cleaning, flushing, etc. So I'm a groomer, he is welcome to see his veterinarian, but there are products that you can get to clean the dog's ears. If you're struggling, please contact me at myfavoritegroomer.com, go to the contact page and let me know you need help or see your local veterinarian. Thanks a lot for watching My Favorite Groomer. We'll see you later.